Honest products from honest guys. The faces of the producers themselves, instead of marketing clones from central casting. Pure appreciation of beer as such, instead of purely price-driven marketing. The 2016 Brewcraft Live in Munich. It's a catalyst, a mirror, and a cross-section of the current boom in beer. Because beer has long since rejuvenated its image as a trendy modern drink. The event is celebrating its fifth anniversary this year. The beer scene has changed dramatically over the past five years and definitely for the better. We're seeing an incredible number of fascinating craft beer projects. The mid-tier and industrial scale breweries have also taken this movement on board. And all this is reflected here at the Brewcraft Live. We have breweries in all sizes here, small, medium and large. Lots of them are new and are showcasing their products for the first time here. You can definitely taste the passion that goes into these products. We've also got a strong presence here from abroad. For example, the Brewers Association is here again. This time, there were more than 70 exhibitors, several hundred exciting beers from Germany, Europe and the USA. Both producers and consumers are exploring the psychology of the amber nectar, honing their sensory skills and experiencing the fruity aromas of the precious hops and relishing the palatability of the individual ingredients. A passion for brewing, not least as a tribute to 500 years of the German purity law. That's a major topic here as well, and that's what makes the event so fascinating. We've got standard bearers here for the purity law, and others who are passionately against it. But they all make fantastic beers. There are two worlds colliding, though they're not that far apart from each other. Because ultimately, you know, the brewers get on very well with each other. In their circles, the only thing that really matters is the quality of the beer. And so there they are, harmoniously coexisting and content to let the public have the last word. And I myself, I don't get paid for politics, but for organizing successful events. One thing became very clear at the 2016 Brewcraft, specialty markets function best when there's a healthy mixture of large and small. And when it comes to the dimensions of enjoyment, the scale is limitless anyway.